I'm not sure anybody had a more unique season than you. You played for three different franchises, um, bouncing around a little bit earlier in the year, and then what did it mean to you to find a home here at the Midway Point? I feel like it meant, it meant a lot to me. Um, like, like you said, I bounced around a lot. Uh, I went from being signed to Vegas, to being cut, to being picked up on a hard ship with Connecticut, to being, you know, let go because JJ came back and then I was uh, I was out for maybe like three and a half weeks before Indiana called. So um, three, seven days and then finally a ROS. So it's a blessing in disguise. You know, everything happens for a reason. I'm a big um, believer in that. And, um, you know, just being able to get the opportunity to finish a season with a, a franchise and, you know, making a push at the end, um, it meant a lot. How did you find out that you were signing with Indiana and can you take me through the emotions? I got a call from my agent and my agent was like, so you want to um, go to Indiana? They're interested. And I was like, of course. You know what I mean? I would never turn down a job. And then um, I did get a call from Catch and uh, we talked a little bit and she was excited, you know, just for me to get out here and to meet me. And once I came here, like I kind of instantly just fell in love with the, with everything. I mean, you know, playing under Catch in itself is amazing and what she's done for the game and who she is. So just having that opportunity was just amazing. The transition seemed so flawless. Was it as flawless as it looked in terms of you had the advantage of joining, I know at the Olympic break, but yeah. still um, it's your third team in, <laughs> in like a month and a half. Um, uh, I thank God every day. He blessed me with the ability to be a, a open person and be able to communicate with people on different levels. Um, a lot of girls like uh, I've already known because I played against them either overseas or some within the, the WNBA season. And then Kelsey herself, we just played, we just got done playing um, together in Turkey. So she always helped out with that. Um, but yeah, it was just, it was, it was, it was, it felt comfortable. Like everything was comfortable. Everybody w welcomed me with open arms. So when I did get here, like I felt like I've been here. On a personal note, I think you're expecting a, a child here in the not too distant future. Yeah. Um, what do you anticipate that moment being like? Oh, uh, so we're having a baby boy and that, that itself is amazing. It's a blessing. Um, it's been a it's been a long road, but to finally have that happen and 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 to feel him kicking every morning is is, is amazing. So um, I'm excited. I'm super excited. I'm gonna have a little twin.